My name is Patrick Lewis and this is the story of my life with Asperger's Syndrome. I first found out I had Asperger's Syndrome when I was in 7th grade at Shackleford Junior High. I was in special ed at the time, but I guess I never really thought about why. One day one of my special ed teachers was reading a book out loud. I don't really remember who she was reading to or why, but something about what she said caught my attention. When I asked her about what she was reading, she said she was reading about Asperger's Syndrome. When I asked her what Asperger's Syndrome was, she said it's what I have. When she started to read the symptoms, I got insulted and said, I don't have that. I didn't realize that she was right and I was wrong until I was in high school. When I was in high school, I was still in special ed, but I was in what was called the ABLE program. The ABLE program was created to help students with Asperger's Syndrome. Each student had a different level of Asperger's Syndrome and different characteristics. Being around these other students, which included my ex-girlfriend, helped me realize things about myself. For example, I tend to take things too literally. Once, when I was little, my dad asked me if I wanted drumsticks. My dad meant chicken legs, but when I said yes, I thought he meant drumsticks. Sometimes I have trouble reading people's facial expressions. Sometimes I can be very ADD. Like the time when I squirrel. I have a terrible short-term memory, but my long-term memory is great. And sometimes I just don't know when to stop talking. I mean, I ramble and ramble, and then I start babbling and babbling. There's one able teacher who has had a big impact on my life, and that was Miss Arnold. She made school fun and explained the work to me in a way that I could understand. She was always there for me, and she still is, even though I've graduated. Because of the ABLE program and Ms. Arnold, I don't struggle with my Asperger's as much as I used to. My Asperger's makes things difficult, but not impossible.